today I'm coming to you with a hair video. Um, I'm going to show you how I curl my hair using rollers and also I'm going to show you three hairstyles that I've done in the last um, three weeks that have been requested a lot by my lovely subscribers. So this is why I'm doing this video for you guys today. I did tweet about it earlier on in the week and I promised that I would get this video out by the weekend because I have so many messages in my inbox, so many comments and um, lots of people asking me to do um, hair tutorials of these um, hairstyles. I'm going to be showing you how to do this, this, and this. So um, I'm just going to talk quickly about the products I used. I roller set my hair using the um, 64 milliliter one. Milliliter? My bad. Millimeter. <laughs> millimeter one. And um, this one's the 54 millimeter. And then I can't remember what this size is, but it's the green one. And then this one as well. This one was mainly for around the hair. This one was for around the crown. So this one's for the sides and this one for the back. Um, they're all universally color coded so um, the purple one's the same size all around the UK. Um, I bought these from a local Afro-Caribbean hair supply store and they usually stock them in different sizes, different colors. There's a yellow one just in between the um, orange one and the green one. Um, but I really like these because it gives my hair more of a um, wavy, more volume than the other ones that I usually use when I go to the hairstylist. But um, yeah, um, this is my, I believe, third attempt at roller setting my hair by myself. I usually get my mum to do it or I usually get um, a hairstylist to do it because obviously they're much better than doing it than I am. Um, I struggled a bit, to be honest, and um, but um, I did it and it, it turned out okay. Um, turned out alright for my taste anyway. So um, yeah, hopefully you enjoyed the tutorial and thank you so much for watching. and then I'm going to achieve the first hairstyle so let's do that right so that's how I roller set my hair my hair is fresh out of the rollers I haven't actually done anything to it apart from take out the rollers and apply my castor oil on it and now I'm going to um, spray my silk spray this Africa one and I'm just gonna lift this up and spray this around yeah. and um, yeah so that's it for the hair roller set show you how to do the first hairstyle um, I've already sprayed my hair with my Africa silk spray and what I'm going to do now is I'm going to tip my hair forward and just mess around with it with my fingers so I'm back so all I did was I tipped my hair forward and I just ruffled up with my fingers now um, because it's already it's already parted in the way that I like to part my hair 
um, for this hairstyle all I'm going to do is just to finger comb my hair like that just just to soften the curls a bit more so that it has more of a wavy feel to it and then I'm just going to mold this with my hands bring this forward a bit And there we have it for this one I'm going to show you how I styled my hair in the video where I was talking about my top 10 summer products a lot of you said you really liked it it's really easy all you need is a tooth comb um, and some bobby pins so I'm going to show you how to do that now so my hair is already parted on this side I'm just going to take a part on the other side almost like I'm doing um, a front poof or a quiff like some of you call it and like that I'm going to take a clip and clip this out of the way while I swap the other bits. Okay, now I'm just going to take my fingers and I'm just going to pull back the hair. Bit by bit. This is messy. I'm going to pin it. Oh, I can't even see. Okay. So I'm just pinning stuff. Pinning the hair away. We're now going to work with this hair at the front. Um, this hair is just going to be finger combed forward and then twisted slightly and then brought up. one I'm going to be showing you guys how I did my hair in the um, recreation of Vanessa's look from the ego video um, yet again I had loads of requests for uh, the hair tutorial of that and um, it's very simple it's like beyond simple and quick and easy like that and um, yeah, I'm gonna show it to you um, all I do is just I just add a piece in a hair piece now this is um this is this is a free tress um, synthetic shake and go hair. I think that's what it is. And this style is called Savannah Girl. Now I've had this for or in May, aren't we? I think I've had this since February, and I just shake and go with it. I just put it on whenever I feel like having long hair, and um, it's really easy to use and stuff. Um, I think the reason why this looks somebody was asking me this. I think it it looks natural because um, it's old. That's because I've, I've used it for like three months and um, I think it doesn't look brand new and it doesn't look perfect like it does when you first get in the pack. Um, some people like the perfect look but I quite like it when it's a lot older and then when it looks a lot more natural so when I put it on it actually looks exactly like my hair. So I'm going to part my hair in the middle using my big wide tooth comb. Um, this is how I usually part my hair when I'm when I put that in. I just do a little like it's like a mid part but um, it's squiggly so it's a squiggly mid part so I just start from there and part it like that so it's a mid mid part but it's a squiggly mid part. I'm taking a small tooth comb from 
maybe about two and a half inches from your hairline just part it from all the way there all the way down to your ear so something like that can you see i'm just going to twist the back like that and i'm going to use my bobby pins again so this is this much hair i leave out this is mine so um, I think that's why it looks natural because I've left most of my hair out well not most but a lot from the front out so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to just pin this away so it doesn't get in the way when I'm applying the extension so I'm take my weave you know and then <laughs> this is so funny and then I'm just going to Oh yeah, I forgot to mention this. Oh, it comes with like combs in it, so one there and and another one on the bottom, so that it um, gets secure. So you just hook this to the front and then you hook that to the back. Um, it has a string, so you can um, pull it and tightly secure it. And also, um, you can wear it as a pony. So if you have your hair up in the bun, you can actually wear this as a pony. Sorry if this this is all over the place, guys. I told you I'm not really that good at doing hair videos, but. I'm gonna try because you guys ask for it all the time so I'm going to insert that can you see that and then I'm going to bring it back and insert the back as well the comb and just pull this into place before I tighten the string so um, that's on there as you can see it actually looks it looks exactly like my hair adjust this to your liking. So now I'm going to work on covering the um, the um, weave. So I already have some hair out there so all I'm going to do is just take my comb and comb my own hair onto it. Take it from this side as well and then just comb it on and it almost disappears now because the front is so nice and um it's got so much volume in it you won't even realize it so um what i do is i just work and i just play around by finger combing all of the hair my hair and the um extensions as well so that's it 